we are at Lugala Secondary School in Shinyalu Subcounty, Kakamega County. We are here to distribute sanitary towels and underpants to both boys and girls, needy boys and girls. Uh, Mama Ibado started the, he commenced this project from 2018, partnered with Kakamega Forest Heritage. On yourself. We have to be a bit selfish. We have improved in enrollment. The number of girls has gone up. For example, last year we had 47 girls sitting for the KCSE exams and 45 boys sitting for the KCSE exams. By 2018, the students were 250 in number, but now the students are more than 650. Uh, able to be here today. Before Mama Ibado started donating pads, our girls used to drop out of school. The reason was they were unable to buy the pads, so they used to get pads from the butcher men and the border border men. Now because of the pads they are given in school, we have more girls uh, finishing form four. Pregnancy levels have dropped and performance has also improved. <laughs> It decreased the pregnancy cases in school because there is no girls who are going there outside for searching like people of Boda Boda to give them money to buy sanitary towels. And it has improved the performance of girls. Like this year, from fours, we have 11 girls who are going to university who got C plus and above. The performance has also improved out of the eight subjects that the students sit for. It is only physics and business studies where the boys were leading, but the other six subjects were led by uh, the girls. Imekuwa msaada kwetu kwa sababu ya kutuletea sanitary towels ambazo zinasaidia wasichana wetu sana. Na imetupunguzia Muziko upande mwingine kwa sababu sasa zingine mzazi unashindwa chinzi ya kununua hizi Eastern Territories lakini wamekuwa baraka kwa hivyo tunashukuru kwa kasi mzuri ambayo mnatufanyia I understand the school started with 250 students by giving us the pads we found ourselves working hard in class because we don't have the embarrassment as we walk out of the class going out. Due to the coronavirus that we had, the pandemic, we've really had so many problems because we were at home. We've now come to school. We know that the Mama Ibado Foundation will continue donating us with the sanitary towels. Because of the pads, it is very easy to teach the students during the afternoon. Before we had the pads, the classroom was very stuffy. It was very uncomfortable for teachers to sit in class. But with the pads, the students change regularly and uh, the teaching atmosphere is very uh, conducive. It has improved in self-esteem. They have confidence. They, they're not shy as they used to because they have something which is protecting them. Also, the pads have helped the girls to be clean and fresh. They no longer stay in one place or they, they're using rags or old clothes whereby that is not clean or fresh. You're going to enable them to go the extra mile. That Lord, from this demonstration that has been shown today, we are going to get more Mama Ibadus. We are going to get more of the doctors and lawyers because they have role models. Lord, we want to thank you even for the workers. We want to thank you even for the parents. We pray, Lord, that you will give us wisdom. You will give us knowledge. Lord, we want to thank you even for the C.S. Amina and her family, oh God. We pray, Lord, that during these trying moments, Father, that you will give her peace and you will give her comfort that only comes from you, Lord.